Hey everyone, Shabby Amir here and welcome back to another episode of Shabby Talk. Now, the day is finally here. If you've been watching my SW Universe mode, you'll know I've been absolutely gagging for this day for, for months and months and months now. And we have had the first 47 names already announced for WWE 2K18. Now, of course, we already knew that we're getting, uh, if you pre-order the game, you're getting uh, two Kurt Angles. Uh, and if you're going to get the Deluxe Edition as I am, you're also going to get Rob Van Dam and Batista. But now we also have another 47 names on top of that. So we're going to go through them one by one. And uh, we'll have a quick chat about some of them. Uh, of course, we've got Bray Wyatt. No surprises there. Dolph Ziggler, again, no surprise. Sami Zayn, Dean Ambrose, Baron Corbin, Kalisto, all absolutely standard. And we come across our first debuting name on WWE 2K18. And that is Akira Tozawa, which is great. I, I'm, I'm a big fan of this guy. And I think it's a, it's a good one. It's also a bit of a statement. So we know we're going to get... A certain level of people. We know there's going to be a pretty good 205 Live roster on there now because Akira Tozawa's on there. We can sort of assume that Rich Swan, Cedric Alexander, Noam Dar, uh, just name a few, TJ Perkins, Brian Kendrick, possibly Tajiri are all going to be on here as well, so that's fantastic to get him. We've also got Sin Cara, we've got Hideo Itami, then another debuting name is Eric Young, which is another a cracky one. It's really good for us because I can never really find the best Eric Young core Plus, it's going to save us a core as well, which is great. Uh, next up, returning after four years, I believe, is away, Jinder Mahal, of course, the current SmackDown champion. That'd be good to have him back on the game as well, because if you guys out there want to build a, a realistic universe mode, that's great to have him, but we can use him as well as part of SWE. Uh, we've got the Bushwhackers still in there, Butch and Luke. Uh, the models are on the game, so why not add him in? Uh, we've got the Ascension, Connor and Victor. We've got Cesaro and Sheamus, which are being touted by IGN as a tag team. So you might have the tag team entrance and everything on there as well. Uh, Gallows and Anderson, again, the club, good tag team. And the first of our debuting women on the game is Nikki Cross. Absolutely fantastic. Fantastic to have her on the game. Again, it saves us a core, plus it's going to give us a, a pretty good strong lady to have in our Carnage roster. Uh, next up is Alundra Blaze. Uh, of course, former... Well, she's been in the Hall of Fame, isn't she? So she's uh, models on the game for a few years now, so I might as well keep her on there. We've got Emma, we've got Lita, we've got Summer Rae. Paige is still in there, which a few people were a little bit surprised about. I'm not I'm not surprised she's in there, but there was a chance she, she could have been dropped off. Uh, we've got the Bella Twins, Brie and Nikki. In some legends, we've got the British Bulldog, um, which would indicate that the rest of the Hart Foundation, of course, bar probably Owen Hart, unless something has changed this year, uh, are still going to be in there as well. Buddy Roberts, again, you'd assume the rest of the Freebirds are going to be in there. Uh, we've got Diamond Dallas Page, we've got the Big Boss Man, Mark Henry. Well, the interesting thing about Mark Henry is during the roster reveal, instead of being classed as a current day wrestler, he was classed as a legend. Might give you an idea about um, about his uh, his current WWE status. We've got Bam Bam Bigelow. We've got Bret Hart. We've got Dusty Rhodes. We've got The Undertaker. We've got a big show. Andre the Giant, Kane, Diesel, and Kevin Nash. They announced both at the same time. We've got Luke Harper, and we've got Eric Rowan. Braun Strowman and Gold Dust. Then we've got three more names. Now, two of these are not a massive surprise, but the third one got me a little bit. Alexander Wolf and Killian Dane complete the four man sanity. However, 2K have also put on the game Sawyer Fulton as well, which I'm so happy about that because it was only a day or two me and PJ Toby were talking about sanity being a part of Carnage maybe next year. And I was saying how I would love to have Sawyer Fulton in the game. So Killian Dane can go as a singles run. So Dane and Eric Young can both go singles. And Fulton and uh, Wolf can be the tag team. Which we, we can do that. We can have a five-man sanity in 2K18. Which is going to be fantastic as well. And think about it. We've got an eight-man tag. Uh, is coming hey, up. Hey, 